Nintendo is stopping production on the current Switch model. And a new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game. Oh, that and so much more. One video coming up. Let's go. What is going on, everybody? How are y'all doing? We have some dope, amazing news items for this video. But first, before we get started with anything, give the video a thumbs up, like, like. I think the last video went over 400 likes. Let's do it again let's get the video over 400 likes all right the first news item nintendo is stopping production on the switch model as we know it according to this new report this is coming from wccftech.com Nintendo Switch SOC production is reportedly stopping this year. NVIDIA is going to halt productions of the current Nintendo Switch SOC system on a chip according to a new online report. That's right, the Tegra X1 that's in the current Switch models are going to be stopped being produced. All right. Speaking with Game Reactor, a person with knowledge of the rumored deal between Nintendo and Samsung for the production of the OLED panels, NVIDIA is going to stop production of the Tegra X1 Mariko chip this year. The chip powers both the re regular Nintendo Switch and the Switch Lite. All right, this is the actual quote. Both the regular model and the smaller and cheaper Switch Lite feature the latest version of the NVIDIA Tegra X1 Mariko. The source told Game Reactor that NVIDIA plans to stop production, stop producing the processor in 2021, but did not elaborate further on what comes next or what may happen with the current versions of the hardware. What this report says a, it's saying is a Switch Pro is coming this year. Because just think about it. Nintendo's producing millions and millions and millions of the current Switch model. Once the Switch Pro launches, they could be just phase out the older Switch model. This is what they're going to do. They'll still have the current Switch model on shelves but only the ones that have already been produced. So I think the current Switch model will continue to sell through 2022 and eventually just cease to exist. And everyone will have to buy the Switch Pro. This causes me to think that they may, they may reduce the price of our, the current Switch to 199, 200 bucks. And have the new, well, we don't know what the price will be. And the new Switch coming at 300 But this is an interesting, a very interesting report. According to this report, Nintendo is going to stop producing the current Tegra X1. Who knows? Maybe they may have a new variant to it that they may, and they still may um, sell the Switch as we know it in a different form factor. But... All signs are pointing to a Switch Pro happening in 2021. I'm thinking holiday 2021 Switch Pro. They should announce it at June around, around their big E3 event. That's their biggest event of the year. And then launching holiday 2021. It's going to be interesting. But the next news item is so 
fire, bro. Dotemu. This software developer, Dotemu, has announced a new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game dubbed Shredder's Revenge. It's an all new beat em up. Um, it's being developed by Tribute Games, the studio that has recently put out uh, Panzer Paladin. This has come from NintendoEverything.com. Bro, but it has the old school arcade type feel. I just posted on Twitter. I got the um, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 1 Up Arcade. My One of my favorite games on the NES was Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2. The second one, the first one was hard as nails. The second one was way more balanced and fun, but I love the game in the arcade. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles was my favorite. Look at the art style. This is what I, <laughs> are y'all hyped when I see this? Bro, this looks lit. This looks, beep, beep, beep. Was that Rock, no, Rock City is the Rhino. Bro, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles was my favorite cartoon as a kid. Shredder's Revenged announced coming soon and almost a hundred percent guaranteed this will be on the Switch, bro. Almost it's almost they haven't announced what platforms the game will be on yet, but a Nintendo Switch version is a no-brainer. The Switch version, I'm saying it now, will be the best-selling version of this game. Bro, I can't wait for this. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, new game, coming to platforms, and we lit Shredder's Revenge. Let's go. All right, speaking of new games, um, um, a new game has been announced for the Switch. This could, another game. This could probably give us our F-Zero feel temporarily. Anti-Gravity Combat Racer Ballistic NG and X Edition has been announced for the Switch. The game is already out, but now it will be coming to the Switch platform. Um, the graphics look a little dated though, bro, I have to admit. But um, if you're a fan of Wipeout on PlayStation 1, F-Zero, we just need an F-Zero game on the Switch. I think we... I think we should get an F-Zero game before we get another Mario Kart game. That's controversial, but we just got Mario Kart 8. Nintendo just might surprise us and pull an F-Zero before another Mario Kart. I'm just saying, bro, and I would be here for it. But this game has been announced. No release date has been announced yet, but keep your eyes peeled for N, um, this um, Ballistic NG NX edition coming to the Switch. Bro! Next news item, and we have to talk about this. Apex Legends has officially launched on the Nintendo Switch, and I have to say, I'm pleased with the game. Dudes are like, oh, it looks blurry. Oh, it doesn't look as good. <coughs> but what you expect, it's a handheld. And so the Switch version for me, and I tweeted this out on Twitter, it's passable. I'm definitely going to be on it. Matter of fact, right after this video, I'm going to be setting up to play on my gaming channel more Apex. I'm going to be playing it. Um, if any sponsors are on and want to run, we can run. But Apex on the Switch. This is what I tweeted out. It's passable, but it's a reminder that we need a Switch Pro. That we need a Switch Pro. I'm really, part of me is playing this game to um, have my um, player, my character leveled up. So when the Switch Pro comes, it's just a natural transition. And so Apex has launched on the Switch. Um, the resolution, uh, I think it was confirmed to be 720p, 30 frames per second. It is what it is. It's a Switch, but it's definitely playable, and I was having fun playing it yesterday. I had a slight headache when I was playing it, but um, it's a dope game. All right. Speaking of, oh, and the developers who ported Apex Legends for the Switch, Panic Button, this is transitioning to my next news item, they have stated that they want to port they would love to bring this game right here valheim to the switch specifically panic buttons head of production 
he has gone re on record to say that he wants to bring this game Valheim to the Switch. I don't know anything about this game, but it looks cool. All right. Um, this is what he says. Head, um, Panic Buttons head of production, Dan Hernberg. He's gone on record to say, I'm not sure if this is my any game pick, but I'm playing too much Valheim right now and would love to port it to the Switch, the manager says. Would you like to see Valheim on the Switch one day? Would it work well on such a platform? Many more players could join the Valheim fever. And so the same panic button, they ported a lot of popular Switch games. I'm, I know Doom, they've done a good job with the Switch hardware. And so the next game that they're eyeing is this game Valheim uh, for the Switch. All right, dudes, those are all of the news. I don't know, we gotta end it with this, bro. Today is Mario Day, March 10th. Happy Mario Day to one and all. There are several deals going on on the internet. GameStop is having some specials, Nintendo specials, Best Buy. Those are two that stick out to me. Um, so go and check out the Mario um, deals on the internet. Happy Mario Day. Mario is the, the not just the Nintendo mascot, but the video game mascot. The most popular video game I, um, character is Mario, and that's not even debatable, bro. All right, what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But, but Oh, my kids want to come in. I'm going to let my kids help me with the outro. You already know how we do. You know how we end the videos. Come on, come on. All right. Sound off in the comment section below. I, I want to know, know. But, but before you, you go, go, bro, click, click that, that subscribe button. button. Stay up to date. All, All things Nintendo. We out, boy. Peace. Peace.